One of the uh, telescopes that we highly recommend, we actually have one, uh, very high quality, probably some of the most superior optics that there are, military quality, security quality, and that is the 3.5-inch Questar and, of course, the larger one, the 7-inch Questar. And there's an interesting story about one that you're seeing featured here in the clip. This uh, unit uh, was owned by uh, Dr. Werner Brunbron of NASA. And uh, there is a local astronomy club that was in the area. This is a, a, in uh, 2003. And they got a call from the director of the Kennedy Space Center who was having trouble uh, using the Questar. And they came to assist him. And they determined that it was uh, Dr. Werner Brunbron's. He showed them the unit. And uh, they were very interested in it. It was kind of an interesting uh, day for them. I'll have a link to the story. But Questar um, said that the telescope uh, was one of three telescopes made for the U.S. Army Redstone Arsenal, which uh, purchased it, and it was uh, number nine. Uh, that was the telescope's number. And um, the U.S. Army Redstone Arsenal by Dr. Werner Braun who is the deputy associate of NASA. This telescope was made uh, at that time, uh, whether it was per order or had been available on uh, 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 1959. And it's the Questar standard. And uh, they do believe at Questar that it had the Pyrex mirror. But this quality of these scopes uh, are very high quality, very interested in terms of lunar, planetary, deep sky. It has Beautiful nighttime star chart, beautiful lunar chart that's embedded into the tube assembly. You'll see that. Uh, the units, they come with the Brandon eyepieces, which are, in my opinion, the most finest eyepieces for planetary observation. Those are made by Vernon Scope. Uh, they do include, if I'm correct, it's a 24 millimeter and an 8 millimeter Brandon. I could be wrong in that, but I can give a link down below in the description as to uh, uh, the details in terms of uh, from Questar's website. But it's an interesting story. I'll have a link to it. And I have some pictures here of uh, Dr. Werner Braun uh, with President Kennedy. And uh, we'll see you in the next clip. Here are the photos.